Welcome to a glimpse into the world of a shy creature, a creature of mystery. It is a snake, but not just any snake. This snake is special. It's called the gray rat snake because it is gray and, well, it eats rats. But we do not see it often. It's like a ghost, a ghost in the grass. The gray rat snake can grow very long. Some are more than six feet long. That's taller than a man. Imagine seeing a snake that big. It might be scary, but you should not be scared. The gray rat snake is not dangerous to people. It is not poisonous. It just wants to be left alone. The Canadian gray rat snake lives in a special place, the Carolinian forest in Southern Ontario. It's a warm place and the snake likes the warm weather. It likes to be near water and can swim very well. The gray rat snake is a good hunter, eating small animals like rats, mice, birds, and frogs. It helps to keep the forest healthy by keeping the populations of these animals in check. But the gray rat snake is not always hunting. Sometimes it likes to just rest. It will find a safe place to hide, maybe under a rock or a log, or it might even climb up a tree. Yes, the gray rat snake is a good climber. The gray rat snake is more than just a snake. It is an important part of the ecosystem. It helps to keep the forest in balance by eating other animals, which keeps their populations under control. The gray rat snake is also a source of food for other animals. Larger birds of prey, foxes, and coyotes will eat them. This is how nature works. Everything is connected. The gray rat snake is a sign of a healthy forest. If we see gray rat snakes, it means the forest is doing well. The ecosystem is in balance. We need to protect the gray rat snake and its habitat. Section four, facing the future. Threats to the gray rat snake. The Canadian gray rat snake is in danger. It's losing its home. People are cutting down the forests, building houses and roads. This is destroying the snake's habitat. Furthermore, the gray rat snake is also being killed because people are afraid of snakes. They do not understand that the gray rat snake is harmless. They kill it because they are afraid. This is very sad. Pollution is also a problem. It's harming the environment and the gray rat snake's habitat. We need to reduce pollution. We need to keep the environment clean. Section five, lend a hand, how you can help. We can all help the Canadian gray rat snake. We can learn about it. We can teach others about it. We can tell them that it is not dangerous. We can tell them that it is important. We can protect its habitat. We can support organizations that are working to save the Carolinian forest. We can donate money to these organizations. We can volunteer our time. We can be careful when we are driving. We can watch out for snakes crossing the road. We can slow down and let them pass. We can be respectful of all living things. Section six, a reason for hope, securing a future for the gray ghost. The Canadian gray rat snake is a special creature. It is a part of our natural heritage. We have a responsibility to protect it. We can all make a difference. We can learn to live in harmony with nature. We can create a world where the gray rat snake can thrive. We can give it a future. We can give it hope. The future of the gray rat snake is in our hands. Let us choose to protect it. Let us choose to give it a reason for hope.